click and highlight the clip, we can go over to the effects control panel, click the stopwatch icon on the scale, start at 100, and then by the end of the clip, we can gradually increase it up to something like 105 or 110. And you can see it adds this nice effect where it pulls your eye in towards the center. So here's another example, we start at a higher amount. So you could start at 110, add a keyframe there, and then at the end of the clip, go down back to regular size, which is 100. And that'll give you a kind of a zooming out time-lapse effect that slowly brings more of the picture into frame. We can add a little bit of left to right or right to left panning, but that's the basics of using keyframes to adjust the position or scale over time to fake some camera movements in post-production.